Monica and today I'm gonna do my top 10 skincare products under 500. I did a similar video for my makeup products and uh, you guys really liked it so now I'm doing it for the skincare ones. I really like these products, they really work well for me and they are under 500. What else does one need? The skin on my face is really oily and the rest of my body is dry. Just letting you know so you can pick your products accordingly. I'll be mentioning all the products and prices in the description box below so don't forget to check it out. And without delaying any further, let's get started. Okay, the first product is the Himalaya Oil for your face wash. This is a new launch for oily skin and I've already reached the bottom of this. I got the peach variant because I really like the fragrance of peach. It really has small granules and beads in it which helps exfoliate the skin and it does not dry your skin but still keeps oil away the immediate effect is that you will feel your skin oil free instantly and it keeps oil at bay for a good amount of time next is the biotic bio papaya sand removal scrub i use it twice or thrice a week and i love it this does help in brightening up my skin instantly skin feels really smooth and supple after using this like you can feel the difference when the dead skin is gone from the surface and leaves smooth skin behind the stopping particles this are really mild, not very harsh on your skin. Texture is really creamy and does not dry it up either. Also, Biotique is 100% natural, so I really like it in this one. Next, coming to a toner, I love the Kaya Pore Minimizing Toner. This is alcohol free, which a toner should be. Never pick up a toner which has alcohol in it as it strips all the moisture from your face. This is for all skin types. I like using this after cleansing my face as it gets rid of all the impurities that is still there on your skin. As it reduces the size of your pores, it helps in sebum production and controls the oil production. So yeah, I love it. This really gives my face a fresh feeling when I use it and it smells good as well. Next is the Plum Green Tea Mattifying Moisturizer. I love this moisturizer, especially during summer, my face gets so oily. If you have oily skin and you think that you do not need a moisturizer, that is the biggest mistake you're doing right now. Even oily skin needs moisturizer. As it says, it's a mattifying moisturizer and it does instantly mattify your face. It does not leave any sheen behind. It does not gloss up. It mattifies my face, which is great. It keeps away the shine from my face for a good amount of time. And this is also good for people with acne as it's non-comedogenic, it won't block your pores and green tea also helps fight acne. And once you apply it, you feel a stretched feeling on your face like a firm stretched feeling which I love again. The plum is 100% vegan and cruelty free which is great. Also this smells so good, I'm not kidding you. It really smells good. The entire green tea range smells amazing. Next is my newly discovered love. It is the Lotus Safe Sun Matte Gel Sunscreen. Now this is again for oily skin type like as expected. This is a gel based sunscreen. Does not smell really good but I'm okay with the fragrance because the result this gives is great. I was using the Neutrogena sunscreen earlier but for the summer it was turning my face really oily and this in fact does not make my face oily or greasy or shiny. It is for normal to oily skin type and if you are an oily skin person looking for a good sunscreen, please go for it. I highly recommend it. It has an SPF of 50 which is amazing and I'm really loving it for summer especially when it's so humid and hot and everything just melts down on your face and you do not need to put an extra greasy layer over your face. Next is the most essential part that we almost skip that is a lip balm. I love lip balm. This one is the Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula with Vitamin E. It also has an SPF of 15. 15. I totally love the texture of this lip balm. My lips are very dry, they get dry very easily. I keep on applying a lip balm after every 2 hours and this moisturizes my lips so good. It smells amazing too and it tastes amazing too. <laughs> Well, you should not eat your lip balm. If you have very dry and chapped lips, you should definitely try this. Or if you're looking for a good lip balm that really works, or if you're someone who eats up your lip balm, you should also try this because it starts working in a very less time and leaves your lips really moisturized like within 10 to 15 minutes. So even if you eat up your lip balm after that, your lips would still be moisturized. Next is a body essential and in summers it's a must that is a body deodorizer this one is from Nivea and the variant is white mask and care it is also a new launch I kid you not it keeps me odor free for the entire day fragrance is really mild 
is soft, not very overpowering. And in summers, we know we all get sweaty, but body odor is an absolute no for me. At no point of the day that I can afford to smell bad. Body odor is a big turn off for me personally, and I make sure that I never smell bad, and this helps keeping me fresh and odor free for the entire day. It's not an antiperspirant, so it won't control the sweat. It would just ensure that there is no bad. This totally comes in, I guess, five variants, so you can pick up a fragrance that suits you. Also, as I mentioned in the starting of the video, that my skin is really dry, and putting on a moisturizer which is heavy, greasy is absolutely no during summer. My favorite is the Vaseline Intensive Care Spray. Being a spray, it is really handy to use. I just spray it on my skin and rub it and it gets absorbed within seconds leaving my skin moisturized and keeping the dry patches away so in summers I absolutely love this and my last product which is almost over is the Plum Green Tea Renewed Clarity Night Gel like I have to restock it I just can't do without it this night gel is so good and I'm so obsessed with it it has really improved the texture of my skin helps me get rid of the mark that I had on my face it also controls the production of oil during the night when I wake up the next morning my face is not oily but is supple and hydrated also green tea helps fight acne or things that could lead you to acne it also clarified my skin over time and since it is doing so much for my skin it is keeping it hydrated keeping oil at bay fighting acne brightening it helping my marks get clear what else do i need also it is so lightweight it gets absorbed into the skin like magic you do not feel that you had anything on if you have oily or acne prone skin and looking for a good night cream i highly recommend this i love this the jar is, as you saw is almost over and i'm gonna restock this case back and it smells amazing as i said the green tea entire range smells really good this is my love in a jar like literally so with this i come to an end to my top 10 for skincare under 500 if you really liked this video found it helpful do hit the like button don't forget to subscribe to my channel share this video with your friends and let them know the good stuff and comment down below which was your favorite product or which are you gonna try or you tried and you loved it i would love to read your comments and i'll see you next week bye